so what's up guys today i'm gonna show you my lg k10 which is a mediatek variant <clears throat> so as you can see here i had a lot of i had a lot of cool stuff a lot of games a lot of apps which is compatible with <clears throat> so today I'm gonna show you that my LG K10 is now rooted so as you can see it is model K430 DSY so <clears throat> some of my games especially this one which is mc4 or modern modern combat 4 is <coughs> not compatible with android marshmallow 6.0 but since i'm rooted let's check so root checker basic so let's verify Congratulations, root access is properly installed. <coughs> so, as you can see here, um, LG K10 is one of the Android device which is very, very hard to root. As you can see, um, I guess uh, four people, including me, who had successfully rooted their device only for people and I could uh, I could know it since we, we had a group here in XDA which is a forum <coughs> for question and answer about routing or developing some modes so here uh, you can root your android marshmallow 6.0 lgk10 in xda forum uh, sorry in my <coughs> in our forum there's <laughs> sorry for that so <coughs> the tutorial for routing your lg k10 uh, <coughs> although it is so complicated to root your LG K10 <coughs> so my friend named C Patrick 3000 at XDA uh, discover how to root the LG K10 uh, but <coughs> I guess um, you should try to root your device since if your Android is rooted you can do some tweaks and some tricks in order to <coughs> modify your device if you want to but if you don't want then don't try it and <coughs> yes we are not responsible for any damage caused to your phone so be careful when rooting your LG K10 since <coughs> it is not a one click root LG K10 doesn't um, one click root doesn't work on LG K10 one click root app like king root or other routing application uh, most of LG device uh, can 
can't have a root access by just one click that's why um you need uh you need to work hard in order for your device to root you need of course adb adb you need uh installed adb <clears throat> ADB application in your PC and Carly Image Kitchen and of course you can download here the Super SU Zip 2.65 which is one of the most important part in routing your device however if something's happening wrong or boot loop just follow the other thread <coughs> which is here in xda the site i'm gonna put it in <coughs> the description in order to unbreak your device so however uh let's try some games so for me in order to play the mc4 without force without the without crashing or the <coughs> pop-up notification which is the device is i mean the mc4 stop running in order to avoid that circum circumstances I use an app name GL tools GL tools is one of the one of the awesome application which can customize your GPU CPU and the shader within the game it could boost or enhance your uh, most of your games even if it's not compatible with and that's right this is an awesome and it it, it needs uh, root access in order to to work in a hundred percent so let's try some games um, this <coughs> PPSS PP games which is UFC undisputed I'm gonna skip that so as you can see our FPS mm, not so good but better than nothing so if you're gonna play this pp as i mean psp games on your device i would recommend to to play with to play it under this <coughs> stage or venue since this venue had no crowd at all and it can provide you a smooth gameplay but um before that i want you to to know that of course if you play an emulator on your device we don't <coughs> we don't expect a, a smooth performance or a better performance or a highly per highly perform gameplay since it is just an emulator not an original android game but still you can you can play uh, some games even uh, in high definition so let's start so as you can see we have a low we have a low FPS <coughs> and the reason behind that is that 
this screen recorder app which is running in the background and it could affect the gameplay of UFC Undisputed um, since it's continuous running but I want you to give my options or settings with this game you can take a look with this um, I try to move the ISO file or PPSSPP games on my internal storage and to see if there's a changes within the FPS but still no improvement at all but if you try to play it with settings you can play it smoothly um, however there is sometimes a drop of FPS but still you can play it the only reason that the FPS now is <coughs> low is that because of the screen recorder up if i remove that then you can see nothing <laughs> joke but if i remove that or i close that the game runs smoothly however there's sometimes a drop in fp <coughs> yes Come on. Finish this. Oh, boom! You know, this is so awesome. Games of mine, one of my most baddest game. But you can also change the quality within this game um, if you want a better performance but even in it is under a low quality you can change from two times PSP to one times PSP both this so I try a lot of changes but all I can get is 18 FPS over 30 that is the highest when I play this game if the screen recorder is off mm, you can also change some things like this but pretty sure it will drop the FPS.
What do you think with this game guys? If you like it, share it. If you really want it, just click and subscribe for more updates. You know, these awesome games. And I'm gonna show you the other of my games, especially the God of War on my next video. So please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.